Okay, what we have here is we have another uh, installation error, kind of like the one we had posted before with the Windows cannot install required files. The problem with this one, it's a gateway computer and it's a Core 2 Dual. And for whatever reason, I don't know why, memory's good, hard drive's good, uh, but we still get, we get this error code here, 0x800717. So, um, it's, the, the error kind of throws you off. But the problem here is I've tried installing Windows uh, 7 uh, 32-bit, Windows 7 64-bit, and they both seem to come up with this error. The only one that would actually work on this system is Windows 7 Professional. So don't ask me why, don't ask me how, but I've tried multiple discs, and it's not the disc, it's not the media, because I'll use those same discs on other computers, and they'll work just fine. Um, so there's a problem with certain probably uh, the problems probably on the on the chipset on the motherboard, but uh, if you like, just uh, get your hands on Windows 7 Pro, uh, maybe uh, download it from Microsoft's website if you have a copy or if you uh, if you bought the download version of it and created your own uh, uh, installation disk like I did, then you should be able to just uh, try it. Uh, but the issue here is certain systems will only take Windows 7 Professional and above. Don't ask me why, but here's the error code you get. Uh, what, you do in, what you do in these cases, just insert your Windows 8 Professional disk and it'll, and it'll go right through. It'll, uh, it'll install fine, no problems. You won't get the cancellation and you won't get Windows cannot install required files in this error. I know some of you have posted in the past on the, previous, on the other video that I have. Uh, for this particular issue. So I'm going to post this on YouTube and if this video helped you in any way uh, Please subscribe to our channel click like uh, Again, this is after you've checked your memory your memory's fine um, And if you if you try the other the other uh, uh, step that <clears throat> for the original video that I did so again, this is if you already did the did the memory remove the memory and you're still getting this type of error code okay uh, your drive is good your memory is good and you're going crazy this is the it will all, certain systems will only take Windows 7 professional okay uh, that's just based on what I've tested on this uh, this computer okay hopefully this helps some people out there till next time bye